Hi everyone, my name is Anika and I'm part of the data science discovery team. In this video today, we're going to be doing a question on a data frame filtering. So here we have, considering the Taylor Swift public data set, um, that that's the data set we're dealing with, you are looking to compare the song lyrics of albums released in 2006 to albums released in 2017. So to do this, you need to create a data frame called DF Years that saves all albums and their lyrics released in 2006 or 2017. So we just wanna, uh, before we even do anything, let's go ahead and see what the actual data frame looks like, right? What data we're dealing with. And it looks like it's just these, um, these different types of songs made by Taylor Swift, as, as well as their you know, title, their, their album, their, you know, just a lyric line and the year that they were released. So here, the goal is to basically just save, um, create a new data frame that saves all the albums and their lyrics released in 2006 or 2017. So it looks like we're going to have to really filter the data frame to include the years 2006 or 2017 and it also gives us a hint here that to use this um to use the or boolean operators so to filter this you want to do df and then in brackets write the df um the column name so i can either do year with uh the bracket notation right or I can use the dot notation. So, or I can do df dot year. Um, and in this case, it really doesn't matter, but you know, we, we just wanna use a bracket notation whenever there's like a space in our, in our column name. For example, if it's like two words and it contains a space in the middle, um, that's when we wanna use bracket notation. So here it really doesn't matter. So I'll just go ahead and use a dot notation because um, it's a bit simpler to understand. And I wanna go ahead and wrap all of my conditionals in parentheses. So my first conditional is gonna be the, the year should be equal to 2006, right? So that's my first conditional because I wanna save the albums and their lyrics released in 2006. And then my second conditional should be their uh, year should be equal to 2017, right? And I wanna use my or operator here because I want songs from 2006 or songs from 2017. And if you were confused of using the and operator, well, it really wouldn't make sense for like a song to be released in like two years in 2006 and 2017. I don't think that can happen. So that's another reason why we just want to use or. So our second conditional will be df.year equals 2017. And then when I go ahead and run my code, we can see that, you know, in our output of these songs are basically released in 2006 or 2017. So when I submit my code, you get it correct. Um, I hope this video was helpful and I'll see you next time.